All right, good morning everybody. Dashing Dink coming at you with another day of DoorDash. Just so you guys can see, I finally got some sunglasses. Well, I got some, you know, glasses cover-ups. <laughs> some slide-overs. They don't exactly fit my glasses, but it'll give me something. However, I don't really need them today because we have got fog thicker than ice cream out here. I've got both apps already running, Instacart and DoorDash. We are finished with the challenge, so now we are just gonna dash our little hearts out, try to make some real money, and see what we can do each day. So, we're just getting into the south end of town. We'll see if the app goes off. It says it's pretty slow right now. Uh, everything is gray, but you got to start at some point, right? So as soon as we get an order, I'll let you guys know. Thanks for riding along with me. And let's see what happens. All right, we got our first order of the day. We're sitting here in the mall parking lot, our favorite place to park. And we got a high pay offer. It's $7 to go 3.2 miles from Starbucks. I got two other DoorDashers sitting in the lot over here. So apparently, my acceptance rate is higher than theirs because we got it. All right, let's head over to Starbucks. We're gonna grab this and we're gonna go make our seven bucks. <laughs> Good morning. For April, yeah. Thanks, Lola. Yeah, thank Appreciate it. All right, everyone. I got a request from one of my watchers to go back to doing some more out the window videos <laughs> or footage. So I'm giving you just a little bit here. We are on our way to. April's place and we have got a lot of fog today it is foggy in Bemidji Minnesota on f you know during the winter in February this is crazy it's absolutely wild Alright April, thank you so much for your order. I appreciate your business. You have a wonderful day. Alright, we just got back into the zone and into town. I just pulled into the mall parking lot, our favorite place to park, and we got another offer. Now, I took the offer. It's a little bit upside down, but it is Sunday morning. It's for $8.65 to go nine miles because it's going to the east side of the lake. But I really want the 865 because I wanna make some money today. It's not gonna take me that long and it's from Taco John's and I like going to Taco John's. The guys are always nice, friendly, and they're quick. So we're just pulling into Taco John's now. We'll go in and grab this order and we'll get this delivery underway. <laughs> There he is. All right. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Have a good rest of your day. <laughs> yeah, it is foggy. That's yeah. for sure. Who, who to thunk? <laughs> February. <Right. laughs> All right, man. We'll talk to you later. Guys, I want you to check out this cool driveway going into this place. So pretty. Yes, this is the driveway to the house.
All right. Thank you, Race, for your order. Enjoy your Taco John's. I appreciate the business, and you have a wonderful day. All right, everyone, we just dropped off that um, Taco John's order. Man, this seems like it's really high. There we go. Um, and three different Instacart batches, one for like 23, shopping for two people, one for 27, shopping for one person, I think, or maybe the 27 was the two and the 23 was the one, I think so. And then there was a $49 order shopping for two people. Now, that one I would take. It's only 75 units for 50 bucks, but it's 31 miles to one of the customers. It's clear down in Lake George, which is a long, long ways away. I don't even think it's gonna be worth $50 to do that one. If it was for one person, I would do it, but not for two. And then the one for 23 is for one person, but it's 175 units. It's only going 0.2 miles. I'm guessing that it's for a, like an assisted living facility or like a, a live-in home type of deal. Cause my goodness, 175 units for 23 bucks. I am not doing that one either. And then the other one, 27, it's like 65 units. It's not bad, but you know, it's at least gonna take me an hour. 23 bucks an hour, it's pretty good money. But I'm gonna hold off a little bit. I'll see if anything gets added to these orders. If that other one could get up to like maybe 55, I would take it, I would do it. But we'll see how DoorDash is, if it's slow, I might head over to Aldi's and do that $50 order. We'll see. We're looking for something dumb to do. Hey, baby, I think I want to marry you. Is it that look in your eyes? Or is it this dancing juice? Who cares, baby? I think I want to marry you. All right, I made a decision. I took the $23 one that's going three miles for two shop and delivers. I think this is going to the same person because I only have one house icon on the map. So I think somebody placed an order and then decided to get a few more things and placed a second order. So as soon as it comes up here, I'm gonna check the addresses and we'll see. We need three of those. Aha. Got it.
zesty ranch. Here they are. Heart-shaped potato puffs. All right, we need two of those. All right, then we need a teriyaki stir-fry. Uh, right here. The Mama Cozy's Four Cheese Rising Crust. All right, we need two of those. We got our uh, two order shot, but I think they're going to the same place. And it says that we're 2.9 miles away. So we'll get this over there and we'll see if this is actually one drop off. If it is, phenomenal. Thank you so much, Jessica, for your order. I appreciate the business. You have a wonderful day. Okay, we got the Instacart order dropped off for Jessica. It was $23.27 or something like that. And it both orders did go to the same place, so that couldn't have worked out any, any better. All right, everyone, we finally got an order. It took a while, but... Um, it's an order from Starbucks. We're gonna go ahead and run in here. I just pulled into the lot, but we will run in here and grab it. Sorry for the extreme close up. I'm trying to look out my mirror here to back up. <laughs> All right, let's go get this Starbucks order. Excuse me. Jennifer C. Uh, grab a strawberry. Okay. She she had a dull on the whole. Uh, my old boss from back home texted. All right, thanks, Lola. Yeah, thank Appreciate you. it. All right, everyone. We got our Starbucks picked up. It took a little while, but uh, we're gonna run this over to. It's getting delivered to Taco Bell. And. Then we have an Instacart order from Target. It was like very few items for 20 bucks. So we're gonna run this down here. We should be able to get back to Target and shop this and get it delivered in an hour. Skylar. Sweet. From Jennifer. <laughs> Have a good one. Yeah.
All right, we got that shopped as quick as we could. Every one of those party size um, Frito-Lay brand chips, I had to punch in manually. It's so stupid. Every time I go there, I have to. I don't know if they just constantly change the UPCs or if it's an Instacart thing or what, but it never scans. I always say incorrect item. Please scan item. Please scan item. But we're only 1.8 miles away. Let's go get this delivered and we still, still might be able to do this in under an hour. Thank you so much for your order. I appreciate your business. You have a wonderful day. All right, we just got an offer on DoorDash from Pizza Hut. It's for $5.12 and it's to go 2.2 miles. So we'll run over here to Pizza Hut, grab our pizza bag, and we'll go take care of this order. Hello, stranger. <laughs> I haven't been in for a while. Yeah? Yeah. That. yeah. <laughs> All right, thank you. Thank you so much, Kay, for your order. Enjoy your Pizza Hut, and I hope you have a wonderful day. All right, we got the order dropped off for Kay from Pizza Hut. And then immediately on the way out to the car, we got a high pay offer. $6 to go 2.9 miles from Taco Bell. So. We'll cruise on over to Taco Bell and we'll get ourselves some food south of the border. All right, guys, they just as I pulled into Taco Bell, sent me a stack 625 plus to go 2.3 extra miles from Arby's. So we're going to go ahead and add that to the route. All right, we've arrived at Taco Bell. Let's go get it. All right, guys, we still have to pick up the Taco Bell order, but they are slammed. So we're going to run over to Arby's and grab that one first. And depending on what it looks like, we might even deliver it. But um, we'll go get Arby's first. That'll give them some time to get through some of the orders. And hopefully it'll be ready by the time we get back. the uh, Arby's order it, she was just putting it on the uh, warming rack when we got there so that worked out good but now we got to head back to Taco Bell and we'll go see if Michaela's order is ready all right man thanks Right. Well, when we got back in there, as you guys saw, I pretty much 
it was pretty much ready. He was just bagging it up and he had to get the drink. So we waited about 45 seconds, probably maybe a minute at the most, but let's get on over here. We'll drop off the Taco Bell first. I'm sorry, doggy. I won't be here for long. All right, thank you, Michaela, for your order. Enjoy your Taco Bell. I appreciate your business. And have a wonderful day. All right, we got Michaela's order dropped off from Taco Bell. Got that $6, and now we're heading to the Double Tree Hotel. And this one's getting dropped off at the front desk, so we don't even have to go up to a room. And this one, I believe, was a 625 plus or 675 plus, something like that. So let's go see what it goes up to. Hello. Hi. I have an order for Mel. Mel's <laughs> not. How are you? Wonderful. How are you? Peachy. Peachy, come on. <laughs> All right, I got to take a quick photo of this. I'll make sure not to get you ladies. Yeah, I don't want to be in there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Do thanks. You for me? Um, sure, why not? Not allergic to nuts? Nope. Okay. All right, thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Ooh, that is soft. Have a good day. <laughs> All right, well, we got both of those dropped off, and this one went up to nine dollars it was a seven dollar tip so thank you very much mel i appreciate that all right everyone i'm just going to take some quick footage of the old downtown area all right there's the old chief theater that used to be the one and only theater back in the day Quick shot down this way. All right, guys, we're gonna make our way home. I'm heading south now, probably gonna stop, pick up a cup of coffee at the gas station. But I figured I'd go over some quick numbers. We did 43, yeah, 43 and some change on Instacart today in an hour and 43 minutes. And then we did 41 and some change on DoorDash. And I first turned DoorDash on at eight o'clock and it's now 12.30. So um, overall in four and a half hours, we did like 84, almost 85 bucks. So not a great day monetarily. It's still pretty slow out here, but we, Got a little Instacart in, we got a little DoorDash in. We made a little bit of money. I didn't have to put any gas on today, so uh, we don't have any fuel expenses. We just have a little bit of wear and tear, my time. But I wanna thank you guys for riding along with me today. I wanna thank uh, folks for subscribing, liking, commenting, sharing. I really appreciate all the support, all the love that you guys have shown me. And I hope you guys continue to enjoy the videos. I'm trying to come up with a way so I can go live. I think I'm gonna have to get a different phone and a different phone package so that I'm not just burning data like crazy. But um, we'll get it figured out here soon. And I look forward to the next video. Again, you guys have a wonderful day. And if you're out dashing, be safe. Get out there and hustle, make that money. And this is Dashing Ding saying, until the next dash.